Hello everyone, my name is Kiki and welcome back to Zootacoon 2. Today I'm gonna build an exhibit for meerkats and warthogs. So finally, Timo and Pumbaa are joining the zoo as well. So I built two areas today. One exhibit that has a little underground tunnel and I built a beautiful garden. And in the garden originally I wanted to place bunnies but unfortunately I didn't have the downloads for them so we're gonna place meerkats inside a garden and <laughs> it's wonderful you will see of course and leave suggestions for what animals you would like to see I have my little notebook now and I'm writing down all of your suggestions and requests so any animals you would like to see if not added into this zoo I will add them into another zoo that I do maybe later on so leave suggestions for what exhibits you think I should do and of course if you have any ideas or what exhibits should look like you can always tweet me an image or something and that would be cool so enjoy the music a little bit and after that we're gonna go into the game and add those animals
here we are guys in the game right now we're gonna take a little walk so i can show you how the exhibit looks like and after that we're gonna play around in the zoo a little bit so let's go and see our new exhibits i had to close the zoo so there are no guests here and i have to adopt some animals because the game really started to lag and this may be the final episode. We're gonna go and do one more walkthrough after this, but after that I'm probably gonna upload this zoo for you guys to play if you have a better PC and stuff like that. Probably it will work just fine. And this is the first outdoor area. A beautiful little area for war dogs and meerkats to jump around and play and do their things and right now we are gonna go into the tunnel Ooh, an underground tunnel of course it doesn't look cool as it looks in reality but you know the game has its limits i've tried to do the best i can this is how it looks when you go into the tunnel i mean it's nice it's really really nice and this is their little shelter house over there we can view them from the shelters as well from over here and from here our zookeepers are resting now because they no longer have the job and this zoo is probably gonna be sold to some other zookeepers <laughs> that's not me and here we are in the garden welcome look how pretty it looks international rainforest phones we have lots of pictures but let me show you the exhibit for meerkats some pictures on the way here it is a meerkats exhibit and they have a lot of their little burrows to hide in if they are not feeling like being viewed by the guests. Some more pictures. This is like little uh, children's board. You can come and draw something beautiful here. And some pictures of meerkats. Beautiful flowers. I always wanted to add these white ones, but never got the chance and here was the perfect chance and here we have some Geckos and a snake a beautiful snake and some more I Think it's geckos, but this is preset buildings. So these guys don't move It's just for the looks And some more pictures of giraffes, zebras. Oh, there are cute bunnies there. And a fox. So cute. And here is the garden. Come sit and rest in this beautiful place. So the theme of this zoo was winter, but <laughs> I just wanted to place some plants again. And finally got the chance to do so in this beautiful garden. It's a random pla plants mostly. Nothing specific. Just put any plant I felt like. And someone wanted to see turtles in this zoo. Unfortunately I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to make a turtle exhibits. Because of the lagging and crashing. But I placed this little turtle log. You can see them here in this garden. And that's all for today's exhibit. I hope you like it. But right now let's go add the animals. And I'm going to show you how it looks from above. So let's uh, put it down the elevated bed. So this is how the exhibit looks from above. Beautiful garden area and the meerkats exhibit and here is another exhibit and this is the tunnel it's so cool so cool so let's go ahead and add animals 
I left the lions so I couldn't adopt these guys. I really like them. I like our Simba and Nala family. So I had to leave them. But let me see. And found the warthogs. And I'm gonna place them in this exhibit. So let's place two females and two males. And we need to add some food for them as well. Maybe something to play with. Like that. Maybe a nice, nice little tire. <laughs> So they can push it. Oh, look at them run. So cute. You're so cute, guys. So we're gonna name you to Pumba because you're so active. Let's name you Pumba. Ah, there you go. Oh, no, no. <laughs> and let's add some food for you. I think these insects would do just fine because still, you know, Pumba loves his insects <laughs> in his Hakuna Matata place <laughs> so that's what we're gonna give him there are enough keepers I think in the zoo yeah they're just chilling here and let's find the meerkats and I found the meerkats finally so let's add these guys here and see how they do in their little burrows over here Maybe add some more of them. There is usually like I think... I don't know how many they are in the pack. Maybe 20, maybe more. Probably a lot. And let's see one more how it looks. With the animals added. Let's go into this cool tunnel again. Maybe I should have added some meerkats here as well. But it's okay. <gasps> Hello guys! Hi! Oh, this is not Pumba. Pumba, is that you? Pumba! Come here, let me take a picture of you. There you go. Oh no, it crashed. Damn it. I shouldn't have taken that picture, Pumba. Well. <sighs> so here we are, back in the zoo. Again. And let's see our meerkats, our beautiful meerkats. How are you guys? They're so cute. Look at them. Look how cute they are. Oh my god, when they stand up, it's so cute. So, so cute. I love you guys. I love you, Timo. And your whole family. So, have you watched, guys, the third Lion King? I know there is a third one as well. Where you follow Timo and Pumba mostly. But let's sit in this beautiful garden and say goodbye to this amazing zoo, guys. Unfortunately, we will have to say goodbye to this beautiful zoo.